Namaskar. In this video, I'll discuss about technique of yogic exercise, Shavasana. The patient was allowed a light breakfast an hour before the exercise. He wore light and loose clothes while performing the exercise, which was performed as follows. The patient lies in the supine position, low limbs 30 degrees apart and the upper limbs making an angle of 15 degrees with the trunk, with the forearms in the mid-prone position and fingers semi-flexed. The eyes are closed with eyelids drooping. The patient is taught slow, rhythmic diaphragmatic breathing with a short pause after each inspiration and a longer one at the end of each expiration. After establishing this rhythm, he is asked to attend to the sensation of the nostrils, the coolness of the inspired air, and the warmth of the expired air. This procedure helps to keep the patient inwardly alert and to forget his usual thoughts, thus becoming less conscious of the external environment, thereby attaining relaxation. The patient is asked to relax the muscles so that he is able to feel the heaviness of different parts of the body. This is achieved automatically once the patient learns the exercise. The exercise is performed for 30 minutes. An experienced supervisor checks that there is no movement of any part of the body, except rhythmic abdominal movements. Physical relaxation is checked from time to time by lifting the extremities and letting them go to observe their flaccidity. Most of the patients learn the exercise correctly in about three weeks. The pulse, blood pressure and respiration are recorded before and after the exercise. After patients learn the exercise correctly, the respiratory rate is usually between 4 to 10 per minute. The dosage of drugs in patients of groups 2 and 3 was adjusted according to the response. The percentage of reduction of drugs was calculated in each case from the original drug requirement before starting Shavasana. Results. Subjective improvement was seen in the majority of patients in both the groups. Symptoms like headache, giddiness, nervousness, irritability and insomnia disappeared in most patients and there was a sense of well-being.